Hello. Hey, Chase Zero. Jay, good seeing you. Good seeing you. Happy New Year. Happy New Year to everyone. Yes, Happy New Year. All right. Let's see. All right, Mrs. Jewel. Yes, good seeing all of you guys. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Yes. Yes, it's so good seeing all of you all tonight. Happy New Year. Hope that you had a safe and wonderful New Year. Yes, indeed. Good seeing you. Good seeing all of you. Yes. Oh, my goodness. It's so good seeing you all tonight. Yes, it's so good seeing you. Yes, thank you for the likes. Yes. Janine, yes. Golden Stones, yes. Thank you. So good to see you. Thank you for the likes. Thank you for the likes. Yes. Be sure to follow. Okay, and share. Be sure to share the videos. Share the videos. Go in there and share those videos. All right, Candy. So good seeing you. Susie, Amy, Annie. Yes. So good. Kennedy. Yes. Yes. Hello. Hello, Step Stepperson. Yes. 76. How are you? Hello. Lady 1221. Sheila. Yes. So good to see you. You guys had a good holiday? Yes, the one that just said hello, Stephenson Candy, 76, follow the host. Yes, thank you. Thank you for following. Yes, follow and then go to the page and check out the, you're blessed. Good, good. Did you have a good holiday? Did you have a good holiday? Yes, Mrs. Beverly, thank you. Good seeing all of you. Frank, yes, thank you for the likes. Thank you for the likes. Okay, so did you, uh, Stephanie, Stephen? Did you have 76 candles? Did you have a good holiday? I know you said you're blessed. Yes. Let's see here. Let's see who we got here. Let's see. Let's see if we can. All right. Hey, hey, how you doing? Welcome, Party 777, yes, Kimberly, yes, so good seeing you, yes, so good seeing you, follow, 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 go and hit the videos, share the videos, all right, so glad to see all of you all tonight, yes, so glad to see you, okay, who is this, let's see, hello, how are you? Hey, can you give me some words of wisdom, please, for 2023? Okay, you need words of wisdom. Okay, in twenty, what, what, what are you, what are you working on doing in twenty twenty? Do okay. you have any goals? Yes, I want to be number one YouTuber in the world. Now okay. I want to be. I'm going to be. Okay, that's now you said that right. Okay, okay, now stop right there. Okay, you said that you're going to be number one YouTuber, right, in the world. Okay, now we're gonna we're gonna deal with that first. Okay, all right. In order to become, okay, you have the mindset to become that. That's what your desire is, pretty much, right? But the question is, are you willing to do what's necessary to become? Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I am. Okay, okay. okay. Are, I know, look, I know what I got to do. I got to be consistent. I got to stay motivated. Yeah. When I, when I tell, and I gotta keep some money in my pocket because yes. I, I feel my bad. I feel like you gotta know, like being an influencer, you need to have money in your pocket regardless. You shouldn't worry about TikTok if you got zero dollars in your pocket. You know what I'm trying to say? Yeah. Well, well, if you okay, when when it comes to when it comes to uh the platform. Okay, nah, the major thing nah, is that you have to be consistent. Life. Okay, yeah, okay, man. you have to be consistent, nah, and you need to like consider it. what it is that you. Nah. Okay, <laughs> let's sing. Okay, what do you want to sing? Okay, welcome seven seven seven. What do you want to sing? All right, let's see. Is it my taco tonight? No. Oh. Hello, hello. How's everyone? Hey, I can't do it, Vaughn. I can't do it. Hello. I want you. 
How are you doing? I'm fine. I'm doing fine. How about yourself? I'm doing good. How's life? Wonderful. Wonderful. Can't complain. Happy New Year's. Yes. Happy New Year to all of you all. Yes, ma'am. Happy New Year to you, too. Yes. Yes. I I, I am blessed to be here, so I'm real happy. (laughs) Me, too. Me, too. We have mm-hmm. made it over. Because he didn't. I know it. it. That's that's the main thing. We made it over. Yes. Because mm-hmm. he didn't do have it to do it. He didn't have to do it, but he did. You better say that. Oh, yeah. Look, I know. that's why. That's why I love tomorrow. Well, come on. They said every day the sun won't shine. Mm-hmm. But that's why I love tomorrow. Mm-hmm. He said riding with my twin in him. That's right. And we both look good. Mm. Yes. She says she is my aunt. <laughs> but I don't know her. I had to look her up. Oh, yeah. Okay. They said, I've been on these people neck so long. Sometimes my foot gets stuck. Mm-hmm. That I can't put you up in my song today. Might not mess with you tomorrow. Okay. And then they, they took a little bit further. They said, beefing? Mm-hmm. You just, you just mad, mad we ain't speaking. But okay. the Lord said, but the Lord said, I'm the one that put the roof okay. where you're sleeping. Mm-hmm. That's, That's right. What That's what he said. He That's said, man. phony. He said, phony. Phony. Mm-hmm. I don't need no new homies. No new homies. Mm-hmm. And I'm the reason I'm, oh, I'm still homeless. That's what I'm yes. saying. Yes, yes. And one song right mm-hmm. pit he said, mama, I'm thugging mm-hmm. outside. We don't oh. need cable. Come on. Okay. Oof. I tell you what. And then she said, bad when I walk in the function. <sighs> Johnny Dan's Johnny on, Dan the on the chain. This, this is good. Mm. That's a word. Mm. That's enough. Okay, right that's a word. That's enough. Yeah. Uh-uh, yes, uh-uh, it uh-uh. is. You said a plenty. <laughs> yeah. Did I not? You said a plenty. That's all I can say. Praise the Lord. You said a plenty. Hallelujah. God. Run it over. Melodies from heaven. Ooh. Rain down on me. Mm-hmm. Oof. Yes. Mm-hmm. I feel good yes. about it. I feel good. Oh, you ought to feel good because he's good just like that. Ooh. <laughs> he's Basically. good like that. You know, when 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 I was last night, I was I was doing I was doing my I was doing my word because I do the word on here. And after I had done the word, I think it was like one o'clock in the morning. And it was already midnight, and I had did my last word. And by the time I hit the button to say that I was done, the Holy Ghost got all over me. And I mean, I just was in here just rejoicing, just me and the Lord. And all I could do was just say thank you. That's thank all you. I could tell him. That's all you can tell him. This morning was thank you. You Come know, on. thank you for just being God. Thank mm-hmm. you for being my redeemer. Thank mm-hmm. you for being my healer. Thank mm-hmm. you for being my provider. Mm-hmm. Oh, you better stop. You better leave me alone with it. Mm-hmm. Just thank mm-hmm. you. That's all I could tell him was That's just thank you. He just so mm-hmm. good. Because he's just so good all the time, and all, all the, the time, time he's good. He's good. And you know what? I would, I'm like the old people in Kentucky now. I wouldn't take nothing for my journey right about now. I I'm not there nothing. Was, there's nothing that I would take for my journey. Oh, come on. Mm-mm. That's what I'm saying. You know, you know, you know, my you know, my mother did. She said, she said, I'm living for the Lord. Mm-hmm. I'm living, for, living the Lord for the Lord and mm-hmm. all the things that he has done for me. Come on, yes. My yes. soul screaming cries, hallelujah. Wow. Thank God. Yes. My, grandma, I, my, grandma, my grandma picked it mm-hmm. up, and I believe you can attest to it. She said she slept all through the night with no pain nowhere about her body. Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. Now, yes. come on now. Mm-hmm. And he said mm-hmm. weeping mm-hmm. is going to endure for a night. A night, but morning. joy comes in the morning. You're not talking to me. Mm-hmm. You're not talking to and, me. And, 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 and uh, Dave, uh, David felt so good about it because he had been so good to him. He said, what shall I render unto the Lord for mm-hmm. all of his benefits toward me? You know, but when I studied it, it was nothing that he could give God because God was just that merciful and he was just that good. Oh, now, listen, y'all. I know that's right. I know that's right. I and all I can say is I know it was the blood. I know it was the blood for me. 
I gotta be the blood. That's what I'm saying. Listen, Nothing listen. but the blood. Listen. When Nothing they were trying the to pull me down. Yes. Yes. I love mm-hmm. this. Girl. Listen, I'm not here to stir your feathers, yeah. but I believe you can feel like Joe. Have you been considered? What? Listen. He said. He said. He said Joe was a perfect, upright man. He said right Joe man. didn't do no wrong. He said, "But mm-hmm. have you considered? Have you considered Joe? Uh huh. And let me let me tell let me tell let me tell you about that Joe story. Because I done had a Joe moment. Okay, mm-hmm. I can testify about that. Mm-hmm. My oldest come on, child, come on. This is what I it. had said out of my mouth, probably about two years before it happened. And I had t- no about a year before it happened. I had spoke." To a young man, and I told him, I said, you know, I said, I done been through a lot, lot of things in my life. I said, but now, if the Lord was to ever to take one of my children, I said, I don't know how I'm gonna handle anything like that. Mm-hmm. How about my oldest child died a year later? Okay, that was the first thing. So, and I remember, I remember just weeping and weeping and weeping and weeping so. I had weeped so much for so long until I couldn't cry anymore, okay? And I was just in a place. Mm -hmm. Now, now, I was just in a place. That's all I can tell you. I was in a place to the point Mm -hmm. that I had cried so much. And the pain, I had lost my mother. And I understood the loss of a mother. That was pain. But now this pain is so oh. greater because it's my child, mm. right? And so I'm in the bed and I'm just weeping and I'm weeping. And then one of my my dear brothers had called me and he had said to me, he said, sis, he said, you know, he said, you're going to have to get up out of that bed. He said, because I think you might be kind of going into depression, right? And mm-hmm. I told him, I said, no, I said, I'm not going into depression. And so I ended up raising the two granddaughters, right? Because the mother had died, my daughter. And so my other daughter had taken them to Disneyland. They had all went to Disneyland. And so her husband told her, you need to call your mother because I was on his mind, right? You need to call and check on his mother. And so she called me and she said, mother, you all right? I said, yeah. I said, you know, I said, I'm just trying to stare around a little bit. So I hung up the phone and then, like I said, my brother called and he was saying, you know, sis, I think you might be going through a little depression. And I said, no, I said, I'm just, I said, the Lord, no, this is what I said then. I said, the Lord knows my heart. I said, but I'm not going through no depression, right? I laid back down in the bed. Mm. In the bed. I dropped my last tear. Mm. Mm. Yesterday. And this is what the Lord said to me. And saying? this is what I said to him. I said, Lord, mm. I was laying in bed with my last tear. I said, Lord, I said, this pain that I have in my heart, mm-hmm. I said, this pain is so deep. I said, I just feel like I, I just can't, I can't breathe. You know, mm-hmm. I can't. The pain is so excruciating until mm. I don't know whether to scream. I don't know whether to pull my hair out. I don't know what to do. I said, but you got to do something for me. I said, because I can't do it myself. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You got to move. Guess what he said to me? What, what he, he said? He said, did you not know mm-hmm. that I knew that you would be here I looked around in the room. I got up out of bed. He said, did you not know Mm -hmm. that I knew Mm -hmm. that you would be here? Well. He said, did you not know that I'm an all-knowing God? Well. Mm. He said, and I have held all one of your tears in the palm of my hand. Amen. Did. Who was a God like that? He said, I have held every last one of your tears mm-hmm. in mm. my hand. Well, and he said, and I got you. He said, mm-hmm. I got you. He said, did you not understand? He said that I not only knew that this day would come, but I have already made provisions, provisions. Come on. for you. 
mm-hmm. to be able to come through. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh. He like said, you know. I'm rocking you now in the crate of my love. Ah. <laughs> he said, I'm uh-huh. rocking you now in the crate of my love. He said, when you can't make it and you can't take it, he said, I am God. Amen. Oh, oh, oh. And he I said, said where would I be? He said, there's no other like me. Mm-hmm. Mm. And so I got through that. A year later, come around. Then mm. I ended up with cancer. Oh. Okay. That's was at key. work and the doctor called me and said, we need for you to come in immediately. They said, uh, when I got there, I told, this is what I told the doctor. I said, uh, excuse me, I'm getting happy. I'm not saying, I'm just getting happy telling the story because it blesses my heart the way the Lord done bless me. Mm-hmm. But I told the doctor, I said, you got the wrong result. I said, mm-hmm. that test got to be wrong because that I don't know, not, you. not no cancer. And I said, and, and she said, you don't have no pain and you don't have, I said, honey, I work eight hours a day. Mm-hmm. And I don't even I don't like have nothing wrong with me. I don't feel nothing. I don't. She said, well, she said, with the type of cancer you have, she said, you don't have a type four. She said, your cancer only goes through a two or three. And she said, we already at probably about two and a half. Ooh. Amen. Amen. And I said, two and a half. She said, yeah. She said, and we're going to have to do surgery. And we're going to see if we can go in and get the cancer. So I went through that. So then I felt good and I was praising the Lord. I said, well, Lord, you done healed me of the cancer, right? And so I'm all elated and praising the Lord. And then, you know, I get to the doctor. Then he says, well, you know, we're just so sorry. We're going to have to put you in treatment. I said, what? Mm. He said, we're going to have to put you in treatment. I was on a, I was on a five long year journey. I just got cancer free. Come on, Lord. <sighs> Oh, hallelujah. Whose report will you believe? You believe. Wait a minute. And the very last day that I went in to do the report to see how the cancer had died, it came back one time in this period of five years. And then they said, you know what? We said that we would not do a particular drug on you. They said, but we either do the drug or we put you back in treatment. I said, well, I tell you what we're going to do. We're going to do the drug and believe God. How about that? Amen. How about it? Okay. And then before I went into treatment, he, the doctor told me, he said, you know what? He said, the paperwork that they give you and everything, it said that I would lose a hundred, about 125 pounds, right? Mm. I looked at the doctor. I said, listen, I said, I'm going to say this to you. I said, if I'm not going to die like any time real soon, I know we only have up to three levels and I'm two and a half. I said, there's any way that I can go home and gain some weight. I need to gain about 75 pounds <laughs> so that I can feed your cancer. Okay. okay. And, right. I said, <laughs> <laughs> and I said, so I can feed your cancer. And I said, because I need to give the cancer something to eat on. I said, because it don't need to be eating on me. Okay, uh-huh. and I do not want to look like I'm anorexia. I do not want to look like death eating crackers. Okay, I want my flesh to look good. Mm-hmm. And the doctor looked at me Call and he said, it. I have never heard anyone say anything like that in my life. I said, well, it's the first for everything. Amen. He said, well, yeah. He said, if you want to go home and gain some weight. And I came home. I prayed. I told my husband, all my children, I should bring me cookies, potato chips, bring me every bit of junk that we can eat. And I would roll over and thank the Lord two or three o'clock in the morning eating cookies, potato chips. I gained all that weight. And then I walked in there and told him, now, come on, let's do the treatment. Let's do it. Well, listen. And when, he, okay. when they got through... When they got through with the treatment, everyone was saying, girl, we just can't believe. People was looking at me talking about, I just can't believe. You you couldn't have had the way you look. And I said to myself, because I had the plan of God. And I want to encourage. I want to encourage somebody tonight. Do not be so holy minded that you're earthly no good. Come on. Mm. God uses who he will, okay? Meaning that I had to go through the treatment 
okay? But I had to believe God. Mm. And even after the treatment, I was on cancer medication for a span of two and a half years, okay? However, I would have to take the medicine and bless the Lord. See, a lot of times we, as Christians, we got it twisted. Because we feel like, okay, you know, I serve this God and why can't you heal me? Well, God used who he will. That's why he used man and he gave man the intelligence and the skill and the wherewithal to bless us. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. But a lot of times in our Christian world, we get it twisted. Okay. I was actually in ministry and I had to give up ministry because the people of God was not at that level of understanding. And I had to separate myself in the church because the church was saying, don't take the treatment. You are a Christian. You are to believe God. Honey, the Lord didn't tell me like that. I'm here to tell you what God told me to take the medicine and pray. Well. <laughs> that's what he told me to do. Okay, and so that's what I did. I followed him, Amen. and in Hallelujah. doing so, so, then they came back and said, "You know what? We're done with you. <laughs> bye bye. We don't need to see you another time." Bye -bye. Okay, Amen. and baby, listen, I'm just as fabulous as I started out. Amen. And Hallelujah. Said, I'm Amen. Hallelujah. And won't he do it? Won't he do it? What's up, I, pre I appreciate you so much for the encouraging words, and you've been through a lot. Yeah, for that testimony. But God, He kept you through it all, okay. and I yeah. really love that for you. And I want you to keep the faith, stay holy, yes. and stay, stay holy, and stay yes. prayed yes. up. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. And 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 what I and what I do, what what I have done is this situation and the trials and tribulations. That's why I said, babe, I got my own Job story. You ain't got to tell me about Job. I know I know the Lord and Job had I know the Lord and, and, and Satan had to talk about me. I know they did. They had to have one because <laughs> that stuff was coming. I mean that stuff I went through I went through a period and not counting what going through with my sons on top of that now that I think about it. But I went through a trying period for at least about seven, about almost 10 years, literally. With everything, family, everybody, okay? But the, the only thing that I found out of the whole matter is that God is true at his word. Amen. And he will not put any more on us. Than we can bear. Than we can bear. Because Come we're on. not alone. That's the whole thing. We're not alone, okay? And that's what he wants us to do is recognize him and understand. And on top of that, what I would say, too, is make sure that you have the word of God. Yes, See, God came and spoke. A lot of people want to be used to God. A lot of people want to talk God, but they don't know God. They don't know mm -hmm. his word. They don't know provisions that are provided. Okay? Mm -hmm. And so that's what I'm here for. That's the reason why I'm on TikTok. Because mm -hmm. I'm the one that's teaching about the bit provisions being provided. Yes, the Lord is coming back. But in the meanwhile, he said, occupy till I come. That's what yeah. he said. Okay? And so we need to understand the provisions that are provided because we are still in this world and not of the world. And we need to be able to to shrew forth his glory. How are we going to do that if we don't know who he is and what he can yes, really do? Ms. Rita. That's right. Well, Ms. Ms. Rita, Rita. Look, 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 look. we'll love to stay here with you all night, but we got to run I, and I tell know. somebody. So you have a good I, night, I, Ms. Rita. You have a good night, I enjoy Rita. all of you all. God, now, what's your name? You didn't tell me your name. What's your name? Oh, I'm Vaughn. All right, Vaughn. God bless. What's your name, baby? I'm Dave. Over here in this corner. Me? Q, what's your name? Me? What's your name? Yes. Keys. All right, Keys. What's your name, sweetie? My name is Dace. Okay, Dace. Well, listen, be sure to follow, and I'm going to follow you guys. And stay in prayer, and I love you guys. You guys are wonderful. Thanks for coming on. Love Bye, you. Miss Rita. Okay. Always remember Bye. Bye. praise will confuse the enemy, Miss Rita. Amen. Yes, it will. Yes, Hallelujah. it will. Come Every on. time. Oh, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Oh, my God. Thank you for following. Thank you for coming on. I appreciate you. Oh, we just had a beautiful time of discussion. This was great. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I appreciate you guys so much. You guys are so awesome. 
Oh my goodness. All I can say is Happy New Year. Continue to follow. Go to my page and be sure to hit the information. Leave your comments. Leave your prayer requests. Amen. Leave me your praise reports. Amen. Because God is good just like that. All right? You all be encouraged. Be blessed. I'm so glad to see you. Thank you for the likes. You guys are so wonderful. You guys are awesome. Amen. God is doing a tremendous work, isn't he? Yes, his glory is being revealed all the time. Oh my God, his glory is being revealed. And I love you guys. I love you with the love of Christ. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, God. You guys are just so terrific. Well, listen, I'm going to get off of here and be sure to follow and go over there on the page and start listening to some of the videos. All right. It is so wonderful to see you. Oh, Dave, it's good seeing you too. God bless you. Yes, I'm so glad to be able to come on tonight. I was I was de debating whether to come on. Baby Jewels, let's see. Baby Jewels, let's see. Okay, let's see who, okay. All right, let's see. Let's see, MacArthur, I invited him. All right, thank you for the likes. And it's good seeing you too, Bay Jewelry. Yes, I appreciate seeing you. And Dave, it's so good seeing you tonight. Dave, Ron, it's so good seeing you. Appreciate you guys. Happy New Year to you. Happy New Year. Happy New Year to you. God bless you. Okay. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Yes. I don't think you have, let me see. I don't see. I'm trying to see here. Hello, hello. Hello, hi. What's well, up? Hello. How are you? I'm doing good. How are you doing? Oh, I'm doing wonderful. Happy New Year to you. Happy New Year's. How you been? I've been all right. I've been all right. Good, good. What have you been up to? Oh, nothing much. Just been at home, just chilling. I went out last night, and that's about it. Oh, did you? Now, have you been doing any composing or anything new? Oh, no. No? Wow. Why not? I think I done gave up on the music. Oh, that's sad. Because you were so good. You were so good at that. You know, you shared that, and it was good. It was, it was so good. Yes, I was you, doing. You, I was doing music that wasn't that was before my time, and and I got tired of it. I guess. Oh, okay. Well, if you got tired of it, then you know that does happen. You know, mm -hmm. and uh, you know what? You you might pick it back up one day. Who knows? Yeah, it's I might. I might do a little do a little bit every now and again. Mm -hmm. You might as well. I mean, I wouldn't. I wouldn't just go it all the way. I, just to see if I still get it. You need to. I wouldn't throw it all the way, and you need to pray and ask the Lord to help you with that because yeah. you would be. It would be such a blessing. Yes, Happy New Year's to you. Yes, Happy New Year to every one of you guys. I tell you. What yeah, you I didn't do any. Pardon. I said, what you what you do for New Year's? I didn't do anything. I worked. I ended up going to work mm -hmm. and coming in and I was tired. I was really tired yesterday and I was just kind of like, oh my God. And so the only thing I did is I just did videos. That's all I did. I did well, videos and I talked to people back and forth. I talked with my family back and forth and did videos. And I think I got to bed probably about one o'clock this morning. Yeah. You know, and I was just like, oh God. And I just, I was just really wore out because it's been such an eventful holiday, you know, because we did Christmas, Thanksgiving, New Year's. I, I mean, just like, it's just like everything just like, oh, you know, everything. Because I ended up working both holidays. I worked before, the day before, and then I ended up working the day after. So it was just like an ongoing 
situation yeah. with me and I was just I was just wore out. I was just worn. I'm not gonna lie. I was just I was just tired. And then this morning I didn't get up until almost ten o'clock. I scared myself. Oh, man. <laughs> I was like, whoa. I said I was really tired, you know, I was really tired. That's you know, awesome. so so That's I said, well, I said, I'm gonna just take my time. And uh, and then I was going to come in and start doing some videos tonight. And then I said, well, and I had spoke to my son and I said, well, maybe I'll go live. And he was like, you should try to go live, mom. I said, yeah. I said, you know, I could go on there and say hello to everyone and then maybe do some videos still before I go to bed tonight. So that's what I was doing. I was just coming on just to give everybody a shout out. You know, see who I hadn't talked to in a long time and let you guys know that I love you guys and I appreciate you and it's good seeing you. Yes, ma'am. Love you too. Yeah, I've just been back on the job hunt, the job that I had for a whole year. They did a layoff, right? What? During de December the 1st. And I, I was one of the What? Oh, okay. And yeah. so you, you're in need of a job. Okay. So are you, so are, do you have any, um, do you have I, any, any resources or any, um, oh, any yeah, resources yeah. or anything where you, were you going to think about applying or? Oh yeah. I started, um, I started working at this other place and I kind of like it, but I think I'm going to have to find something else. I'm not really. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Well, you know what? I'm going to pray. If you don't mind, I'm going to pray that the Lord bless you. You want us to pray? Yeah, sure. Yes, ma'am. Okay. All right, most gracious and divine Father, Lord, we come in the name of Jesus, so Lord. And Father, you already know the situation is at hand. Father, we ask that you would bless him and you would place him, God, where you want him to be, oh God. And Father, we ask God that you would bless him, oh God, in the, in the workforce, oh God, that you would give him favor like never before. And let your peace, oh God, rest and rule in his spirit that he knows that this is the right place, oh God. And Father, we just thank you for being able to come to you and talk to you about what concerns us and our needs. You said that the very moment that we would call God, you said that you would answer. And we thank you now that you hear our prayer. We ask that you would forgive us for our shortcomings and our sins. And we'll be careful how we bless and praise you. In Jesus' precious name now, we bless God and amen. Amen. All right, all right. Well, it was good seeing you, precious. You know, and and you just go ahead on and and be blessed, and then be sure to let me know when you find that right job because I want to hear about it. <laughs> oh, yes, ma'am. I sure will. You know I will. Okay, and I appreciate you. And I'm going to get off of here because I do need to do some videos tonight. And it's already okay. what seven o'clock? Is it seven? Oh, six. Seven, it's eight o'clock. Yes, I better get I better get to cracking and, and try to get some stuff done before I go to bed. All Where right. you at eight well, o'clock? It's, it's ten o'clock here. Well, it's eight o'clock here. I'm in California. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm in California, but see, I mean, I need to be kind of looking to get in the bed by ten. That's why I said I better start yes, right now. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Thank All you. All right. Listen, listen, it's a pleasure talking to you and happy new year and take the Lord with you and start thanking God. Just we've been praying. So now the, all you need to do is get up in the morning and say, Lord, I thank you for that job that you have available for me. From this day forward, start saying that and put yes, God on the forefront and you will see him move in your behalf. OK. Yes, ma'am. All right. Love you guys. Stay up. Bye bye. Right. Happy New Year's.